While Ali Manik Fan was living in Vethala of Tamil Nadu, during his occupation in fisheries, his attention was diverted to farming. I was uh, thinking about the growth of trees and cultivation. I did some research there and I found that it was quite uh, proper. The coconut trees and all those things uh, started bearing well. He used to nurture a passion for plants and trees. He triumphed in the noble farming practices he introduced. It was a tedious task to prevent the seepage of soil in the coastal areas of Vethalai. He tided over these obstacles by planting trees, making fences and hindering the sea winds. Here when we came, it was not like this even. All these things were removed and only sand was uh, here. It was all white sand. So the trees were not there. So I wanted to do some experiments by recycling these things by putting here and putting some sand over it. Here only I got the idea of uh, do nothing farm. His wish to experiment cultivation in a place completely devoid of water, away from the sea, made him reach Valiur. When he was buying 10 acres of land in Valiur, it was nothing but an arid, barren land. He patiently trailed and tested various plants to find out the type of plantation that was the most apt and suitable for the land conditions. Forest will develop by itself if we leave it untouched and uh, this is uh, not grazed by the cattle. I have found out that is true. It can uh, a desert can become a fertile land by itself without uh, human intervention if we protect the trees from damage. We came here first in 1990. We purchased the land and there was nothing here. Nobody nearby. We made a hut and started living in that site. And uh, we were here for four years. At the time, many trees have started growing. This place itself, so many rabbits and snakes and everything was there. But now, because these trees are destroyed, nothing is there. I had heard about a lot regarding he stay there, a man who have come from uh, Lachadyup, staying there and experiment with uh, the soil, experiment with agriculture and all. But when I met him, it was a quite surprise to me that he's a, he's a man, multifaceted man. I cannot call him a mere uh, agriculturist. How did he... he encourage or tolerate uh, agricultural life there. But according to his vision, he says that uh, water scarcity was the main problem when I was there. But I could understand water will come in search of plants, where plants are there. So the first time the yield was very low and down, but now it has come up. So his life itself uh, uh, is a, an experiment with the life. Our aim is uh, to have big uh, ponds where the rainwater will collect and uh, the water supply will be there 
for a long time. That is uh, for about five five acres, one acre uh, pond area should be there. At that rate, we make big some five five cent like big ponds in which the water will get filled up when it rains. And this rain will stand for four four or five months. Then that will supply enough uh, moisture for the trees which are around. So that is how we are developing this land. His experiments found fruit and the land soon flourished with greenery. This is the Do Nothing Farm. A farm where there are no interventions intending profit, just promoting natural vegetation. Now there are numerous species of life forms here in this once dry parched land. I think that people should eat what they get from the trees where they live. Here when we came, we tried to live on the leaves available here and we found that we could live without any other thing from the market. Even the migratory birds don't miss an opportunity to visit this guest house of Manik Fan. This small garden is a living evidence of Manik Fan's strife against global warming. Pragerdiye atmiya da na oru uyar na thale mundu manishen. Ekko spirituality na kapari. Sathethil, naamada jiyo thil, naamada sagajiyi vigalu naamulo akkathane. Kootai chernu vo na oru simbhri ana naamada jiyidam. En na ana sathyo. Ii sathethe tirichar na vikti ana li manifan. Adheham naamada jiyo thil oru jaiyiva thalem kodi onda. Karna naamulo hotte ki pragerdiye nilayal kundi lla. Naamoda pom, pullum pujum. Pachigalum, Margangalum, Saruva, Saraja Gangalamundo in the bottom. Namalda Jeevism, Adena Yadu, the Tertillum disturbed with Yade, Adenu Ropo, Aduai to chair, the Jeevikina, or the Jeevi the Shaili. Adu Pudadana Galtane, Marshi Vadim Beritin, Sufi Vadim Beritin, Bautha Vadim Beritin, Kuli, Tudachiana, Adgan Thilim, Masanobu Fuko Kailim, Ivan Elichilim, and Azara and Jinta in my local Kakana Kayim. Adindi Tudachiana, Ali Manifal and Garna. Now I see in some places the rivers have been dried up and then the lakes are drying up. All this is because of intervention of man. We must leave the nature as itself and what we can contribute, we have to contribute, not change or destroy.